Hi there, students. To give something a whirl. Okay, to whirl is to make something go round and round and round and round. The blades of the helicopter whirled above us. A whirlwind, a whirlpool. Yeah, something going round and round. But we have this informal phrase to give something a whirl, to give it a try, to see what happens. So if your friend makes a suggestion, you could answer, why don't we give it a whirl? Why don't we try doing that in wood instead of uh, paper? Yeah, let's give it a whirl. Why don't we give it a whirl? To give something a whirl. Let's give it a try. Let's try it. Okay, almost let's make it go round and round and see what happens. Yeah. Okay, this is informal. I wouldn't want to write it but when you're speaking that's perfectly fine it's fairly informal to give something a whirl to give it a try to test yeah um let's give the cinema a whirl this weekend okay so you could give the object itself a whirl why don't we give that indian restaurant on the high street a whirl yeah try it give it a try and see if it's any good okay um it's ages since we used um, our bicycles. Why don't we give them a whirl? Yeah, we give them a try and see how they go. Okay, so when you're speaking English and you don't know a word in vocabulary, in your vocabulary, invent it and then give your invention a whirl and see if people understand it. Okay, so enough. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. To give it a whirl, give something a whirl.